We, the jury in the above entitled action, find the defendant, Orenthal James Simpson, not guilty of the crime of murder. If you're ranking amazing, shocking courtroom moments, you have to put the verdict in the O.J. Simpson case at number one on that list. Why in the courtroom, please? O.J. Simpson is like this shared cultural moment. It's got to be at the top of the list. Everybody paid attention to that trial, and if they didn't, they were missing a major moment in American societal history. You had race, you had sex, you had the wages and sins of celebrity, and all of them became shoehorned into this little courtroom in Los Angeles. There were so many memorable moments in that trial. Do you use the word nigger? No, sir. How about that, Mr. Fung? Did you think it might be advantageous to you to stay with the defendant for your acting career? I don't think we're going for the same parts. <laughs> I, I, I put this knit cap on, who am I? I'm still Johnny Cochran with a knit cap. If it doesn't fit, you must acquit. If it doesn't fit, you must acquit. If it doesn't fit, you must acquit. I mean, we still remember it. Get, get this glove on. It doesn't fit. That's the moment. Why didn't the prosecution know that it wasn't going to fit? You never ask a question you don't know the answer to. End of the story right there. End of the trial for the prosecution. Mr. Simpson, would you please stand and face the jury? The most memorable moment in the O.J. Simpson case, to me, the one I'll never forget, is the verdict. Not guilty of the crime of murder in violation of Penal Code Section 187, a felony upon Nicole Brown Simpson. And the look of utter astonishment on everyone's face, everyone on all sides was absolutely astonished. Not guilty of the crime of murder upon Ronald Lyle Goldman. And everybody was tuning in for that schadenfreude moment where you watch O.J.'s pain as the guilty verdict is announced. Is this your verdict? So say you won, so say you all. Yeah. Everybody was surprised with the verdict. Even look at the juice. He looks surprised. It was one of those moments people say, I remember where I was when the O.J. verdict came down. I remember all of these black people screaming and yelling and cheering, and they're like, oh, yeah, wow. I'm like, well, what, what's going on? And then I'm looking over at all of the white folks, and they're like, hmm, hmm. The definition of winning changed with that case. It showed that you can win in the court of law, and you can lose in the court of public opinion. O.J. Simpson may have been found to be a not guilty man, but he's not really a free man. He is forever tainted by that verdict, by the outcome.